Crack the gates open! We've got wounded! I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. You've been good to me and my family. You saved Duck from those monsters, and you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. I won't forget that. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. Those look like the people who raided my Calm camp. Down, you're paranoid. Fuck you! Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? That's right. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. He's not dead! Somebody help me! Come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it! No! <laughs> Sounds like a car. It's a shitload of food and supplies back here. We have to take this, Clementine. We need it to survive. Don't worry, little girl. Bandits got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. Looks like this is our lucky day. Yeah, this might actually go smoothly. We deserve it after last time. come down on staying or going you mean packing up the motel and getting in the RV yeah we've been talking about it but have you made up your mind yet we should go the motels run its course and it's not safe you damn right it has we pile into the RV and don't pull over till we see water and if Lily's dead set on staying then well that's the way it goes Just like last time. Over the rig, into the pharmacy, and scrape together whatever supplies are left. We didn't leave much in there. Hey, we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. <laughs> Shit. You okay? The ladder's come loose. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got in her. I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. No kidding. like she's had it. What now? I'll find another way up. We better get a move on. They're blocked by all the fallen concrete. Huh. <laughs> Lily's not doing so good, huh? Well, we killed her dad. We did kill her dad.
still upset with you for agreeing to take that stuff from the station wagon? I think she understands. Hope so. Not like we had much choice. Right. Duck was asking about that guy at Herschel's farm last night. Really? I wasn't sure it phased him. Of course it did. It was a scary situation for him, Sean dying and all. I'm just worried he'll always think it was his fault. You're sure you're up for this? Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. Jesus, are you okay? I'm fine. Shit. I'm sorry, pal. I thought it'd be healed up better. You're lucky it wasn't any worse. You could have. <sighs> Scream, do they? Jesus, I don't think so. It's a girl. We have to help her. How? There's no getting to her. We gotta do something. Fuck. We gotta shoot her. Put her out of this misery. You don't know we're here. What do you mean? I mean, we leave her alive and she draws them all to her. Buying us time. Can't. Think about it. We're always worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes. Should be good to clear this place out, but we ain't got all day. Get everything you can out of these racks. Don't forget underneath the counter this time. I'll clear down here and then we gotta go. Snatch this up, let me get that. She's gone. There's not much time now. Oh shoot, no, I think I think we saw some, a little bit yeah, we forgot something. How in the hell did they know where we were? Still clear. Let's hustle. Oh, Jimmy, help. Nope. 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 Mm -mm. Come on, 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 come Get out! 
if this worked. some stickers in a drawer and I put them on my walkie hey sweet pea that's neat I'll find you in a minute looks like we got the kid on watch again what'd you get we might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone come and rape our women and children So, what did you get? A lot of stuff. We're fine, by the way. Nice work. This will keep us going. If we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? We'll freeze our asses off here! His piling into an RV with you two, after what you did to my dad, is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. Take a look at the wall, Lily. That's not graffiti. Those are bullet holes. And we got enough arrow shafts sticking out of it to dry our laundry. We have to go eventually, Lily. We don't have to do anything. You didn't want to go because of your dad's health. But he's gone now. Easy, Kenny. At it again, are we? Can it, Carly. Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. And I don't think you're capable anymore. We're strongest together. It can't be you versus us, Lily. We're sorry for what happened to your dad, but we're in this together now. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. That's BS, Kenny. And you know What it. about medicine? What about medicine? We deal with shit as it comes, just like we always do. And when 15 bandits hop over that wall in the middle of the night? What then? You just gonna deal with that? Everything that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. Do you know how we got these supplies? We got lucky and let a girl get eaten out there. What? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She gave us enough time to get everything we could out of the drugstore. You just let her suffer like what? Like bait? What is happening? You weren't out there. You guys couldn't try to save her? Don't take that tone with him. It's the first smart thing he's done in a while. Glad to know you think being a killer is smart. Hey, if you don't agree with it, then we'll take everything we got in these bags and put it in a pile marked, No Hypocrites, and you can use everything else. We got what we needed. It was just something that had to happen. Lee's right. We've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. You should be thanking Lee for not shooting that girl. It's not so easy for him. Look, Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on Earth. And it's coming. This way. It's not going to be easier out on the road! How would you know? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right, stealing. And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day. Now everybody get out. She'll get over it. She's riling everybody up otherwise. You understand, Ken. She's right about one thing. 
None of this is getting any easier. Oh, things are coming to a head. You could say that. Well, I think you did good today. And I find myself thinking that most days. Thanks. It's probably worth following up with Lily about what she was saying about missing supplies. With her wound up the way she is, I don't want to see her paranoid. No question. And I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. Did you come in here to give me hell or to coddle me? You have to chill out. You think? I'm not going to play the victim, but you and your buddy might have had a hand in my instability. Can I do anything for you? Haven't you... No. Yes. I could use your help. There's a traitor. Somebody, one of us, out there. He or she or they have been taking things. For real? Who? What do you got? Yes, for real. And I don't have shit. I just know. Lily. It counts off and it's the good stuff. Antibiotics, oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. I see the count and it's fine. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not stupid. I know what happens if I start a witch hunt. So you want me to start one? I want you to poke around. What's there to go on? I found this tossed into the garbage. Huh. We don't toss out equipment, we fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you were using it when you shouldn't. Facts. Okay, I'll poke around a little bit. Thank you. If you don't find anything, I'm just going to assume it's you. A mystery. Jesus, Doc. I'm sorry. Um, I heard you guys talking. You need to unhear all of that. Can I help? What did I just say? You're the <laughs> what detective, I just say? And I could be Dick Grayson, your ward. That's Robin. I know who it is. You can't help. And if you tell anybody, it will be trouble. Secrecy. Did you hear what I just said? I won't tell a soul. The part about not helping? You can't help. Shadows. Oh my god. Something wrong with this boy. Damn, he's he gonna help me anyway. Boy. Talk to Lily yet? Yeah, she thinks supplies have been walking away. Really? There's some broken equipment too. I'll look into it. Thanks for doing that. What I wanted to say was, I've been thinking a lot about you. Oh, you've been thinking about me, huh? I think about you too. <laughs> Our group is small. You're small. You're a convicted killer. Carly, Jesus. And I think people should know. Not because they deserve to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. People need to know because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. You don't have to tell everyone, but think about who you trust and take the opportunity while you have it. You're probably right. 
course I'm probably right. People might be pissed, and telling them might cause some trouble, but it will be a far cry from what'll happen if they don't hear it from you. Yeah. So you'll do it then? Uh... I'll let people know. You're totally right. Good. I think it's for the best. Don't call me small. Hey, I won't call you small ever again. <laughs> now, is there anything else you want to talk about? Do you know anything about this flashlight? It's broken. I know it's broken. And the batteries might be in backwards. It uses just one. Everything should. What was the question? Did you break the flashlight? No. Okay. You, uh, have any thoughts about Lily? I worry about her. That's about it. She keeps trying to run things, but it's just not working. Do you feel safe here? Show me a bath with a heated floor and a high-rise apartment and hand me a full-bodied Malbec and then I'll feel safe. I don't know, this place is fine, but we all know that that could change at any second. That's true. I'm gonna look into this thing. Good idea. Alright. Hey, Clem. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. Aww. What's that you're working on, Clem? It's called a leaf rubbing. My teacher, Miss Moore, showed us how to do them when we went to the botanical garden once. See? It's the same. Um, kind of. Ah, oh, that's really something. I'll make one for you, too. Aww. You didn't accidentally break a flashlight, did you? No. Did Duck say I did? No. Did uh, Duck break the flashlight? I don't think so. He's just always blaming me for stuff. Like what? Putting a bug on his pillow. Did you do that? Yes. <laughs> oh, she's so cute. <sighs> Clem, I need to talk to you. Okie dokie. He's like, did you do it? Yeah. Before I met you and before the plague, I killed somebody. Oh, so that's what... Yeah, that's it. It was a bad thing and there's no explaining it. Why are you telling me? Because I didn't want to keep it to myself anymore. Do you have any questions? You can go on back to your things. I have a feeling if I tell Lily, bro, she's going to flip out. I'll be like, hey, guys, um, I'm a murderer. No, I'm stuck. <laughs> hey, you two. How are you doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. We all carry guns now, and I don't like it. It's the way it's got to be. I know, but I'm not getting used to it. I'm sorry. How are you, Lee? Do you guys know anything about this broken flashlight? Fuck. We don't got many of those. Yeah, it's a problem. The glass and the bulb are all busted out. I saw some broken glass over by the ice machine. I meant to clean it up before the kids hurt themselves on it. I forgot, though. Okay, good luck. Good luck. Can I talk to you about something? Sure. Is everything okay? He's probably looking like the hell. I've killed before. I mean, before the walk. You mean you were a murderer? You <laughs> say that like it was my job. Well, what are the details? It was in a dispute. Would he have killed you? I don't know. Tell me what happened when you were locked in the fridge at the dairy. Oh 
my God. Uh, I held Mummy back, and Kenny made sure Larry didn't get up. What did he do? He smashed his head in. <gasps> Damn. I should have talked to Kenny first. Everything keeps changing. Yeah. Shoot, these are times where we gotta do what we gotta do. Ain't no bullshit. I gotta talk to Kenny. I gotta tell him. Hi, guys. Kenny, you got a second? I need to tell you something. Sure, pal. What you got? So funny, she was like, You know that man murdered, right? <laughs> it's serious. Oh, no. What'd the she devil do to you? Shut up, man. I killed someone. Different than Larry or the St. John's. Different from everything. This was before the Walkers. Uh... I know. I, I didn't say anything when I met you because I was with the girl and, you know, I, I was worried. I just smashed a guy's head in with a 50-pound block of salt. You saw me do that, right? Yeah, I did. And you're talking about who we were? The fuck does that matter? It's everything this mess oh, is doing now, Lee. Shit. Look, is Duck safe around you? Of course. Then shut it. You don't owe anybody any kind of explanation. Wow. He took it better than anybody. <laughs> I bet. I think I gotta tell, uh... Hold on. Oh, yeah. Gotta talk to him. Hey, Ben. What's up, Lee? Hey, Ben, I need to tell you something. Sure, Lee. Is it about my watch? I'm trying to do a good job. You're doing fine. I'm, uh, I'm a convicted murderer. Whoa, seriously? Why would I joke about that? I don't know. Um, wow. You're a part of this group, and you should know. I've never met a murderer before. Well, I hadn't, I mean. I know what you meant. Thanks for trusting me, man. I... Uh, I... Ben, relax. Okay. <laughs> uh, I think the last person I need to talk to is Lily. Uh, fuck. Hey. Find anything? I haven't found out anything Well, there's yet. nothing to find in here. Ask around. Jesus, investigate. Okay, okay. I need to tell you something. What is it? I killed someone before all of this. You think that's news? I guess I hoped it was. Worse, did you think that story died with my dad? Anything else? No. There's some broken glass on the ground. Oh. Hmm. Pink. Hmm. Dark. A clue. Maybe. What do you think it is? I thought I told you you couldn't help. I'm curious. You don't say. Maybe it's a sign. It could be. It's pink chalk, which is weird. Okay, back to investigating. I just don't know what to say about that boy. Oh, snap.
Clementine, no, what did you do? No, she didn't do nothing. I just want to talk to her. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. Do uh, you have any pink chalk? No, it's gone somewhere. Hmm. Do you want blue? No, no, it's okay. Damn, somebody stole it. Psst, Lee. I found something. What is it? I found this piece of pink chalk and a scuff of it over by the gate. Really? Totally. I was calling the scene for clues Yeah, and... Duck, I got it. Good job. What's wrong with this boy? You know what? I'm, I'm not going to be it. Look, I can so be an asshole. Because I'm like, bro, I told you not to help. Oh, damn. I mean, hey, I already told him good job, so he'd be alright. Somebody was over here too. I suppose I should go out there and look around. You stay here this time, seriously. Okay. <laughs> oh wait, hell, I, I haven't told him yet. Have you found anything else? Oh. Just the chalk. I also found some bugs underneath the stairs. Don't tell Clementine. Okay, I won't. You didn't break the flashlight, did you, Duck? No, Mom and Dad won't let me touch any of their stuff. Lily neither. That's probably for the best. Stay inside the gate. I will, I will. No, I'm not playing with you. Those bandits gave us hell, but they've been quiet for days now. Hmm, what's this? Uh -oh. You haven't come up with anything, have you? I came up with this. It's got a bunch of meds in it. It was in a grate on the outside wall. And there's a sign on the other one. Holy fuck. Yeah. Okay, we line everybody up. Everybody. Somebody is killing us. Stealing from that supply is the same as slipping into your room at night and cutting your throat while you sleep. You die. What is the difference? What if Clementine gets sick and we don't have what we need? What the hell? You don't fucking steal from us! Who the fuck is that? Yo, we got our people out there! Out we ain't fucking around! What do we do? Oh, Lily. shit! They're gonna start kicking in doors any second. Lily, what the hell are you- Stall them. What? Just keep them talking. Do whatever it takes to stop him pulling the trigger. Made the biggest mistake of your life. Oh shit. Shit. Enough of this bullshit. Drew, stop putting your boot to these doors. Yeah. Hold it, asshole. Take it easy. <laughs> Why are you doing this? Just leave us the fuck alone. Why? This fucking guy. Why? Because we gotta. That's why. What will it take to reach a deal? About twice as much as you've been giving us. You got it. Done. Is that so? Well, I suppose we ought to hash out some terms then. I don't like no hash. Man, shut up or I'll... Christ! Damn! Oh, shit! There you go, Lily. Uh, uh! No! Dang it! I try to, I try to, get wow. We gotta get out of here. No, 
Oh, shit! Get those bastards! Cover our people and get them to the RV! Yeah, I see that. That was that, that was a test run. There. Smoke him out. We gotta get out of here. No shit. Get those bastards. Cover our people and get them in the RV. Ooh, let's go, bitch. Go Come on. Shit. Let's go, bitch. Now, get over here, hurry! Man, you saved our asses. Get inside. Help! Gotcha. Hang on. Yep. Yeah, he just he just strolled up on him. He's like, yep. Mm -hmm. Got your ass. Come on, bitch. Come on, bitch. Got your ass. Oh, okay, there he is. I see him. Got your ass. Got you. Hurry, come on. Come on, y'all. Get inside. It's okay, Clint. Get in. Kenny. Last chance. Get down here. Shit. Ooh, she made it just in the nick of time, boy. Cat, Jesus, are you okay? I'm fine. I'm fine. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! I'm sorry. Everything's fine, Everything's ben. not fine. We need to figure out how this happened. We just lost everything. Well, we're lucky as shit to have this RV. And nobody died. Cat's head is split open. I'm fine. Somebody in here caused this. Settle down back there. The bandits have had our number for weeks. This is different. Somebody was working with them. Whoever it was was slipping them our meds. They didn't get their last package, so they attacked. Calm down back there. That's nuts. Lee found a bag of supplies hidden outside the wall. It's true. So, Carly, is there something you want to say? Please. We have to get it out of you then. Back off. You are in no position to make demands. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're just pointing fingers. I didn't just come up with this. I've had my suspicions. Probably not the best time, Lily. If not now, when? Look at what just happened. We're all okay now, though. Why her? It seems like a stab in the dark, Lily. She's always so eager to see what supplies we found. She never talks about her family. She could be related to those bastards for all we Whoa, know. Whoa, my family's not a bunch of meth-riddled forest people. They're fucking Lutheran. You're not saying it wasn't you. It wasn't me. Like, look, maybe we should vote or something like that. Vote? What? Just look. Carly's a stand-up gal, and maybe this was all just a mistake. We need to look at the facts. Let's calm down, we'll eat, and we'll deal with it. Yeah, let's do that. Let's just let it go.
People make mistakes, and yeah, this is a fucking doozy. But it's not worth it, Lily. Then what do we not forgive? Honestly, tell me. Kenny can kill my dad. Carly can steal from us. Where's the line? Nobody was stealing anything. Was it both of you? What? I've seen you two together. Was it both of you? Look, just let me out. I didn't do it, but I don't like this. I don't like where it's headed. Look me in the eyes and tell me you didn't have anything to do with it. Lily, lay off of him. I... <laughs> Shit, what's Damn. going on up there? I hit something. We gotta stop. All right, well, we can deal with this now, then. Kenny, is it safe? Should be. Everybody out. Lily. Out. Kenny, the RV has some surface damage, but there's a walker trapped underneath. God damn it. Everyone, keep your eyes peeled. You know what? We shouldn't just kick you out. We should hear what everybody thinks. I think you should chill out. I'm not gonna take this. You can push Ben around, but you can't push me around. I'm really sorry you feel that way. I'm starting to think maybe it was both of you. No! Ah, this dumb fuck walker! There's no way it was Carly. It was somebody else. It could have even been someone sneaking into our camp. That's ridiculous. That's what you think? Yes. Okay, fine then. Kenny? I don't know. Fuck. Just stop, would you? Well, your vote counts for you and Katja. We don't need all these votes. What do I have to do for you to trust me? I'll do anything. I'll, I'll do watches for months. Huh. The hell you will. Hold on, I'll man. get more food, more medicine, anything. Just you think any of that is good now? Just let me stay, please. God, please. You're pathetic. Look at you. Stop panicking. Seriously, Bill. You need to stop and just take a breath. Do we need any more evidence than this? Fuck evidence. Stop treating him like this. Shut up, Carly. Ugh, I've heard enough out of you. Kenny, what's it gonna be? Just give me a damn minute. Ben, you have until that walker is dealt with to tell me it was her and not you. Stop this. You're torturing him. No. Ben, stop. This is about trust, and I've never trusted you. Lily, lay off. I can't, Lee. You know I can't. Thank you, Lee. Please, listen to him. Please don't kick me out of the group. We won't. Tell me. Now. She's tripping now. There. I got him. Please, let's just get back That's in the That's not RV. happening. You think you're some tough bitch, don't you? Like nothing can hurt you. But you're just a scared little girl. Get the fuck over it. Take a page from Lee's book and try helping somebody for once. Now, what the fuck's the problem? What the fuck? Drop it. Holy fuck. Kenny, what's happening? Keep duck away from the windows. Jesus Christ. Get in. We're leaving this crazy bitch. She couldn't be trusted, Lee. I swear. Please. You're not coming with us. I'll die out here. You bother yourself. Care. You're a murderer, Lily. We can't have you with us. I'm a murderer? You've had Lee with you this whole time. I don't care what he did before. If we keep you with us, how long until you get me? I was trying to protect all of us. You know I damn well it wasn't her. Left. Get in, Lee. Let's go, you guys. Told you to chill out. Oh yeah, and they're coming too? Oh yeah.
Lee, a word, please? What the fuck? What's up? Is Doc feeling all right? What the fuck? Happened during the raid. What's the plan? We've never had a bite victim in the group before. I'm going to keep an eye on him and see what I can do from a medical perspective. We keep the same plan unless something changes. East. Guys. What else is there to do? We thought you should know. Important to stay honest with each other. Anyway, if you could tell Clementine, we would appreciate it. Wow. Duck is bit. Huh? He got bit by a walker trying to escape the motel. I don't feel good. What about Carly? Gone, but won't come back. Because she was shot in the head. That's right. It's horrible. Yeah, it is. That was some bullshit. Told her to chill the fuck out, bro. I'm glad I have you. Me too. I heard you outside my treehouse that day and thought about dropping a hammer on your head. What? Why? In case you were up to no good. Before you, there was this other guy. He was yelling and trying to get into my house. He wanted to take the TV and tried to break the glass door with a rock. Then some walkers came and scared him away. The door was open. He was dumb. Ah. <laughs> yeah, dumbass. Jesus! Jesus! Hold on now, hold on. Nope. 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 We got something up ahead. What was that? What the f Y'all was not expecting that. Is there any way to get around it? Doesn't look like it. On foot, maybe. Can't really afford to do that now. This seems like a safe area. All this brush will stop anything from creeping up on us. Why don't you and I go look around? Yeah, everyone else relax. Clint, stay close to Kitty and Cat, okay? Lee, if you come across anything to drink, uh, if there's a dining car or something, I think Duck's a bit dehydrated. It's a freighter, huh? Be careful in there. What? You think there might be something dangerous inside an abandoned locomotive? That would cross my mind. I don't know. There might be some walkers in there. All right, let's see.
Everybody's been living in here. Yeah, man. Shit, think they're gone? I hope so, but this looks recently used. Be on the lookout and have your guard up. Map of where the train goes. I think these tracks might lead to the coast. Route 27, Savannah. That's where Kinney's got us headed. Now let me jump out. Got one. Walker, sitting in the chair. We got him. Uh, shit. Okay. Surprise me. Yeah. Let me see. Hey. I don't think this guy came back. Christ. light is blinking push it push it why not are you fucking serious here look it's just the brakes okay i'll give you that one this fucker works seems like it i'll be damned how the hell do we get it moving i don't know that's mr amtrak over here no clue Found this in the boxcar back there. Whoa, is this what it looks like? I think so. This hoss will take us right to Savannah. A hundred tons of steel. Put a thousand walkers between us and the ocean, and we don't have to give a shit. I can't believe it. Just have to figure out how to get it. I'm sure we can figure it out. How tough could it be? No idea, but we'll find out. That's the spirit. Ben, if you could keep an eye on the girls and duck, I'd appreciate it. I'm gonna make sense of these controls. Man, this could be exactly what we need. All right. Let me see. I have no idea what to do with these. 
I have no idea what to do with these. I have no idea what to do with these. Shit, this is it. Instructions on Star... Damn, pages are gone. I can kind of see the indentations from the writing. Bunch of maps about Georgia's cities. Nothing about. It's a bunch of papers. Ooh. Oh, oh, I think I know what to wait. I think I know what to do. Yo, I think I know what to do. I think I need something else, though. Let me grab this one. I'm gonna go to the back of the train and I'm gonna see. Are you serious? If I can break it loose first. Hey, okay, what could get that out? Let's try one more time. It's stuck. We need a bunch of force to break away all this rust and whatnot before I can pry anything free. Dude, one of these has to get that unhooked, unhinged. Bunch of force to break away all this rust and whatnot before I can pry anything free. Okay, so I can't go back. Maybe there's something up here I'm missing.
It's in pretty good shape for a wreck. It's in pretty good shape for a wreck. Jesus! Oh, Jesus! Nah, fam. This door's gonna hurt. How in the hell are you doing? Okay. This might be the dumbest thing ever. Come on. Wow. That was stupid. I was hoping you would hit him or something. Okay, what the hell? Oh, okay. I got you. Yep, there you go. Okay, let me see if there's anything else in this car. Nope. This is it. Instructions on starting the engine. Damn, pages are gone. I can kind of see the indentations from the writing. We got a problem. What? We still got the rest of the train attached to us back there. Shit. I tried to yank the pin out, but it won't budge. Well, we ain't going anywhere until it does. Oh! Wait, 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 wait. Uh. Shit, this is it. Instructions on starting the engine. Damn, pages are gone. I can kind of see the indentations from the writing. I need to talk to Clementine. I think I have to do. You remember what she did with Leaf? I think I need. I think I need to do that. With that. There's a notepad on the train. Do you have any pencils or anything in your pack? No, I wish. Maybe in the RV. What do you need it for? There used to be something written on the notepad that I need to know about. Well, if you're not using it, I'd take it. I'm out of paper, and there's all sorts of new leaves around here. Wait. So, what happened? Here, I found these. If Duck's up for it. Thank you. That's very thoughtful. He isn't fussy, you know. What? Most kids, they're really fussy about what they'll eat. Hate vegetables, that kind of thing. Not Duck, huh? No. The most trouble I ever have is making him use a fork. Thank you, Lee. Sure. How's Duck? I don't know. Tired. Which could mean a lot of things, right? Yeah. His body's probably fighting whatever's in it. Exactly. Anyway, let me know if anything changes here. Is Ken all right? What is he doing? He's put his mind to figuring out the train. What about you? Same thing. Sort of. I found some instructions, but I can't read them. Oh. Well, I'm sure someone can help you. You know, let me talk to this dude. 
We found a notebook that we think might have had some starter directions on it, but the page is missing. Well, I'm sure you guys will figure it out. Oh, let me talk to Clementine one more time. Hey, sweet pea. You okay out here? I don't think Doc feels good. Uh, me neither. What? Okay. Uh, I gotta figure out a way. Oh, well, let me get in the RV then, real quick. No, 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 no. Go back inside. Go back inside real quick. A pencil. Sharpen, too. There we go. There's the pencil. Read it now? Yeah. Should be able to just follow the steps to get the engine on. Sounds good. There we go. Okay. Uh engine startup six. Da, 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 da. No, 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 I think that's supposed to be down. Fuck. Hang on, let me, let me read this. Uh... Nothing about the train. Okay. 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 Up, down, up. All right. Up. Son of a bitch. Whatever you did, lit the dash up. So far, so good. All right, all right, all right. Okay. Number five. Let me see. Oh shit, no. Now we're talking. Nine, nine. All right. Okay, I think nine's uh, the one outside, I believe. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, so left, right. Left. Right. 
Let's go. Holy shit, we're golden. Yeah, we are golden. Man, feels good. Let's fucking enjoy this. Come on, let's see if she'll move. Man, I did most of the work, dog. <laughs> Yours. Damn it. Of course, we're still attached. Can you go find out where we're stuck and get us unstuck? Yeah. I gotta go see about that, uh. Now I think we can use it. There. Hey Kenny, we're loose. Let's go. You touch any of my stuff? Oh shit. Take anything. I asked if you touched it. I didn't. I guess it's no worse for wear. Name's Chuck. Charles, if you fancy. Lee. Is that your crew outside? Yeah. And the guy up in the cab. Him too. I saw you walking through here and thought about scaring the pants off you. What? But I couldn't force myself to do it. You're still kind of freaking me out. Train folk will do that. Already met everyone outside. They all warm to me right quick in direct sunlight. You met Chuck? Yeah, I did. It's so nice to meet someone normal for a change. He gave us candy, Ben too. Kenny? Sure did. Man shares my love of the road. That's for certain. <coughs> I'm awful sorry your son's not feeling good. I appreciate your concern. Well, with a little TLC, I'm sure he'll be fit as a fiddle in no time. And I can offer y'all whatever I got, although it ain't much. Thank you. We'd like to do the same. Why don't we hold off on... Uh... Stay with us. We'd like the company. Eh. So that's it? We're cut loose? Seems that way, yeah. Great. We don't got much left, so just gather whatever you have. Let's go. Wanna ride? Well, it sounds like you're taking my home. That's a yes, then. Can't find anything better for keeping the creepy crawlies out than that boxcar. Doc's sick. Get on the train, Clementine. He's getting sicker. Let me look at him. Look at his eyes. We can keep going if you want. 
Damn right I won't. That's what we're doing. I think Lee just wants to talk it through. It's talked through! Get on, Kent. I'll be up front. I don't want to hear any nonsense until we get where we're going. Gotta be hard on you, eh? Three adults taking care of three kids. No disrespect, son. Yeah, <laughs> ain't no disrespect. It is. Your daughter's something else. She's not. She's a survivor. Takes after her dad, looks like. Lee. Lee, I need you right now. I need you to go get Ken. What, sir? Would you get that off his face? My hands are full here. Wait. Uh. Thank you. Could you just get that off his face, please? He's out of time. We need to stop this train. Okay. Damn. Damn. Let me talk to her real quick. I'm gonna go get Kenny. Hold on tight in case the train stops fast. All right, it's time to be reasonable, man. I try to hold off as long as I could, man. Stop the train. Katja needs you, Kitty. Duck will be fine. I'm sorry. I shouldn't talk like that right now. Go back there and tell my wife everything will be fine. What is the goddamn deal? He's a little sick, but we can't just quit. It's a scratch. He's not like the others. Jesus, all y'all are just making it worse. Stop the train. Stop it, goddammit! Fuck you, Lee. You're gonna listen. Or what? Wait, what the hell? Oh. How the fuck do you calm down after a day like today? I'm not talking to your friend. How many sons are you gonna let die? Shut your mouth! I'd get you to stop this and bet your ass I'm gonna. I've had your back. Don't make me fucking regret. 
You're gonna get your you shit. You wanna hurt people because you're afraid. Losing duck ain't enough for you. Because you're fucking lose everything acting like this. I'll fucking kill you before I let that happen. It's hard, but man, dude, like he said he was scratched. Man, that was a bite mark. That was teeth marks. You don't get that from a scratch. Oh boy. Again, it's. I think it's time. The boy's been bit, in case you haven't figured that out. Start looking like, and... Take as long as you need. There ain't no time left to take. What are we gonna do? We can't allow him to become one of those things. But what if, what if he doesn't? Kenny, I love Brother. you very much. I love our son more than life itself. I need you to hear me. What you are saying, that he may not turn, is foolish. But no. It is, though. You know what happens when you get bit, bro. Hell, Come on, Kat. we get scratched. One, you let me know. Isn't there some sort of pill or something we can just give him? Stop it. Just drift off to sleep. Right, hun? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know. But we know it's here. Oh, nothing. that's right. The brain, yeah. Fuck. Just who, then? You want me to? You don't have to. I'll do it. No, you don't have to. I'll do it. No, it should be a parent. No parent should have to do something like this. He's right, Cat. We can say our goodbyes and just let that be it. I don't know. Lee, you'd be doing this family a great service. Why don't we take him into the forest? So Clementine doesn't have to see. Yeah. Give us a moment to say goodbye. Of course. is dying. I know. What are you doing? I'm gonna make sure he's okay. But how? He's bitten. By making sure he doesn't come back. Oh. Look, Clem. Things are... What the... No! Ben, what the... take Clementine into the train. Go. It'll be fine. Uh-oh. What? Cat. Cat. Gotcha. What? Why, cat? Honey. Oh, fucking God. <laughs> oh, my God. I, I, wow.
Oh my goodness. What do we do? Give me the gun, kid. I'll do it. Damn, so not only he lost his wife, but damn. Oh, he actually stood and watched. Oh, damn. I thought he walked away. Damn. I thought he was going to walk away. So he didn't have to see it. Damn. Damn. He lost both of them. That's sad, man. Oh, yes. Hey, how you doing? I don't care what reasons you had for doing it. No reason to go and tell my girl she's going to end up dead. Because she is. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's going to come up tomorrow. Y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't going to make it. What do you know? I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then what? We do what's best for Clementine. Oh, well then, you do have it all figured out. Never mind. Look, sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map, for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... It won't. If it were, you gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. She's a little girl. And she'll die a little girl if you treat her like one. You gotta consider her a living person. That's it. You're either living or you're not. You ain't little, you ain't a girl, you ain't a boy. You ain't strong or smart. You're alive. Look at her hair. You got her running around with a mop that's gonna act like Velcro to any hand swinging its way. Find some scissors in my pack and take care of that hair before a walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun, because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. I don't mean to tell you how to do your job, but too many people have died already. They have. And seeing another little girl die might just do me. I hear you. A plan, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. You have any family? Out there, somewhere. Been sort of on my own for the past, oh, 14 years now. I'm sorry to hear that. No one to blame. Where are you headed? Uh, that way. I mean when we get to Savannah. Got a few ideas. We'll have a talk when we get there about whether or not you folks want company. Be safe up here. You betcha. Okay, so you were just being okay.
Let's just get to the ocean. Are there any maps up here? I don't know. I just uh, want to look over one with Clem so she has a lay of the land once we get to Savannah. Mind if I get by you for a Can you just leave me alone? Hey, Ben. Hey. Carly didn't have to die, you know. She would have killed me instead. Yeah, maybe. Aren't many of us left. Yeah. You, me, and Kenny. Clementine. The homeless dude if he sticks around. Are you gonna be able to step up? I can do just as much as anyone else. Good. I hope that's true. Yeah. So what's going on with my man? Hey, Clint. Did you talk to him? I did. He had some, uh... He explained himself and made some good points. Look, we're not gonna let anything bad happen to you. But there are some precautions we have to take. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Don't worry, sweetheart. Okay. What should we do? Well, I'm gonna figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and, uh, tidy up a little. So you can't get grabbed so easily. I like that. Good. You need to know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Got it. I mean, with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Okay. Wow. See, Little girl's being taught scary. this. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. To aim, you look right down the top through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. Is there anything else I should know? I know these are just bottles. But you have to aim for the head. I know. Only the head. Unless it's not a walker. Kill the head, kill the man. And then? Head or body. Anywhere. I don't want to think about that. You're right. It might be a lot for your first day. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Imagine that. A little girl is being taught how to use a gun. <laughs> like, I know under the, under the circumstances, you know. Good. Don't lock your elbows. Okay, let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly, and I'll cover your ears. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. You okay? My hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I have to? Yeah, you do. Okay. Okay, aim a little bit more to the left. Steady now. Almost got it. Oh damn. Hold on. Uh aim right. To the right. I saw where that uh aim lower. There you go. I got it. Excellent. Good shot. Okay, now where are you pulling all these bottles out from? <laughs> to the right a little bit lower oh wait a minute uh... a little bit more to the left okay a little higher I'm trying to figure out where it, where it's going a bit to the right aim a little higher There we go. There you go. Nice. I 
did it. Hey, she got yeah, it. You did. Good job. A regular old protege. That they were walker heads. Good. Just like you should. They're not walkers, though. No, far from it. But you know how these things work now. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay. I feel good. Not so scary, huh? Nuh uh. Oh, yeah, we gotta do something about that my hair, too. My hurt, and my ears have noise in them. Like... You'll get used to it. What do you think about Chuck? I don't know. Me neither. He might be an okay guy, though. You think? We'll keep an open mind about him. He's probably had it pretty rough. What a crappy day. Crappiest. Three months ago, I'd known what you'd be seeing. I don't know if I would have taken you with me. I probably would have run out of food. You're damn near starved with me. I'm glad I came with you. I need to look around for a few things that'll make sure we're prepared when we get to Savannah. That would be good. I hope it's safe there. Ah, uh, me too. All right. He's lived here a while. The whiskey. I hope we're not on this train much longer. They look clean enough. Ah, there we go. Hey, Clint. Probably not gonna like this. Oh no. What happened? Nothing. We have to talk about your hair. It's not safe. That's not nice. What? Are you saying it smells? No. Because it does. Kinda. Do you remember when Andy St. John grabbed it and I got mad? Yeah. Well, that could happen again. And if it's a walker, well, we need to trim it. Just a trim, right? I need to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed. <sighs> okay. Makes sense. Mind if we do this now? I guess not. Don't mow. It's a good thing. Do you know how to do this? <clears throat> yeah, of course. I don't believe you. Well, good. Good? It means you know when someone's lying to you, which is another valuable survival skill. So you did kill someone before? Yeah. I'm glad you finally told me. Me too. You've killed lots of things now. It doesn't even matter. Killing is bad no matter what. But you do it now to protect yourself. And to protect me. Doesn't make it good. But you have to. I do it because it's necessary. Walkers aren't people. Okay. I think I'm about done. I can probably tie these pieces back with something. Here. I have some hair thingies. You do? Uh, yeah. Lily gave them to me for sleeping. There. All set. Does it look <laughs> dumb? <laughs> no, you look cute. And a lot harder to grab. Hey, I think I did a good job. All right. Let me go ahead and... Uh, Check on the rest of the folks.
found this if you want it. Damn. Didn't realize I had it left. Thank you. Want a nip? No, I'm fine. Suit yourself. Mm. Anybody in there want to share a drink? You let them know. Will do. Chuck wanted to know if you needed a drink. He's got some? Yeah. Yeah, that'd help. Yeah, give me that map. Man, you got your head. Giving the bandits supplies. What? Oh, hold on. You want to run that by me one more time? It's all my fault. Jesus, Ben. I know. They said they had my friend, that he was with just, them. Just stop. Fuck. Can we even trust you? Yes. Why'd you have to go and tell me that? I just... No, just don't tell anybody. You can't take any of it back, so don't. Okay. You still want to talk to me? I don't have a lot of choice. Unless you're going somewhere. I... I guess I'm not. See you. No, 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 we need some more information. What are you doing out here? I, uh, couldn't be back there anymore. I needed some air. Anything else? I was thinking about talking to Kenny. I guess not. I'm dead serious about you keeping your mistakes to yourself. I can tell. You get why, right? I guess. You better. See you. Yeah. 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 All this because of you, man. Carly was just beginning to like me, man. I was, man. Ooh. I should throw you off this train. <laughs> We're going to have a I believe I can fly moment when I throw your ass off this train. <laughs> oh, my God. And what we're gonna do when we get there. We don't know what to expect. The city could be bad or totally under control. The thing is, you and I, we're a team, you know? And a team needs a plan. Aside from everyone else, when this train stops, you and I should know exactly what we're doing. A plan. I like it. <laughs> Good. I think we should look for your parents. Really? Yeah. You need to know if they're okay. Well, if they're not, what happened to them? I'm sure they're okay. Yeah, it's best to stay positive. That's what Dad always says. Let's look at the map. If we can figure out where they were, we can start there. Looks like we'll come right through town if there's nothing on the tracks now. We've got a good chunk of Savannah here. What do you think? They always stay in the same place when they go there. It's, uh... Hmm... Hey, don't worry. We'll figure it out. Have you ever been there? Once. Well, think about it. A lot of hotels on here, but read this map and 
Maybe it'll jog your memory. They've got really tasty desserts. It's called the M M something Mar. Is this it? The Marsh House? Yes, that's it. So we'll head there. Yes. You think we have a good plan? I think it's very good. Can I tell my parents? Sure. Go ahead. All right. How do you feel? Good. Better. I'm glad we have a plan. And you're a good little chef. Thanks. I guess we should see how far... Oh, shit! Hold on, everybody! Damn! So it was Ben, you bum! Wow. Fuck, 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 fuck! Maybe we could walk? That's fucking stupid, Ben. I'm just saying. Hmm, I don't know. I ain't got much experience with y'all's fortitude, but we could probably deal with that. We got a goddamn train. That thing's not full of milk, Charles. That's gas or diesel. Something that's going to explode. You got to get a hold of yourself. This a crew here. This ain't shit. This. Yo, if you keep screaming like that, you're going to get your face chewed off. Are you guys going to be trouble? Because we could have just kept walking. Oh, shit. No, we're friendly. Put your hand down, kid. That's what everybody says. We know. Let's give these guys a break. We'll see. You guys got a problem with your train? Yeah, you're standing right in front of it. Dude, it's a wreck. It's not so bad from up here. Send your buddy up to have a look. Anything goes sideways up there. We won't let them escape. Yo, okay. Finally met some new people. If I come up there, you better not be murderers or thieves. I guess you'll have to find out. A group of guys is what we need. They're what you think we need. We're doing fine. For now? What about when... Stop it. Hey, dude. I'm Omid. Lee. Krista. What's the deal with the train? We're driving it. Oh, man. Look, you want to help us out? We could use some able bodies and... Yeah, we, we really need some help. What's in it? Oh, shit. God damn, you guys have a kid. What are you doing up here? Do you know how long it's been since I've seen a kid? Shit. What's your name? Clementine. Oh, so he gets to swear. Oh, this is great. See, things are looking up. You're not her dad. He down there? It's that obvious? To me. And no, he's not down there. Huh. What's your story? I came across Clementine alone. First day all of this happened. We've been together ever since. And everybody down there, they're cool? Yeah, they're cool. Kenny lost his wife and kid. Man, how long ago? What time is it? Uh, I don't know. I... Four? Maybe two hours ago. God damn. We're sorry for anything that's happened to you guys. A train is awesome, though. A tank is your real problem. We'll help you with it. But if we see anything we don't like, we're moving on down the road. Alone. We'd appreciate the help. We can't just blast through it, I guess? If you could get it down, the rest would probably be pretty easy. We'll start there. We'll come down and settle in and see if we can help. All right. It's empty. That's about the only useful thing in here. Oh, damn. 
and see uh There's no way I'm pulling anything apart down there. You know, unless I was the Incredible Hulk or something. <laughs> Whatever government work was going on here didn't seem to help. Let me see. Okay. I think I have to go back down. This thing is mangled to hell. No releasing it. No nothing. I'm gonna go back downstairs real quick. Guys, this is Omid and Krista. Not big on welcomes? Like I said, we could use some good people. We just wanted to say hi and say your train is pretty cool. But we are not looking for charity. We could help you guys, though. Maybe. The plan is to cut that tanker down and be on our way. Seems like plan enough to me. You want to start in on that tanker? I'll get to know the girl for a minute, if you don't mind. And why don't I show you how this thing works, in case something happens. Really, Ken? It's probably for the best. Someone might want to have a look inside of that station back there, too. Sounds great. Let's do this thing. I guess I'll wait. Wait, so what's the... I think I have to... Okay, there we go. Can I follow you over there? You don't like the new girl? I do, but it's like we're a team, like you said. Yeah, all right. Come on. Clementine and I are checking out this train station, all right? Hustle over if you hear anything. You should wait for me before trying to open doors. Sorry. Uh, luckily, it's locked. We'll get better at working together. <clears throat> mm, won't but. Doesn't look like that thing's worked in years. I think there's a... Oh! Windows open up there. Maybe I could look in. Why don't I put you on my shoulders and you can peek into that window up there? Sounds good. Ugh. 
Okay, I can see in. What do I do now? What do you see? Lots of crates and stuff. Maybe we can find the key or figure out a way to knock this door down. Kenny'd probably have me pick the lock, which actually might work now that we have the time. I think I opened it. For real? I think so. Well, I'll be damned. All right. Let's go. Be careful. I'm supposed to tell you that. Hey, come on, partner in crime. God damn, it's dark in here. Maybe I can hold the door open? I don't like that. I'll prop it open with something. All right. Locked up good. They didn't have much business back then. That's exactly what we need. Over there? Yeah, we need to get in there and get that blowtorch. Locked up good. How we doing? Good. What do we need? Something to help us deal with the tanker out there. There are keys over there. For the gate? I hope so. Can't reach them from here. There's some space up there, but not much. We're lucky I'm so little. Yeah, we are. Hang on. Wish that thing was in my hands instead of over there. It's too dark otherwise. Hang on. No! You okay going over the top of the- Yeah, definitely. The keys are on the opposite wall. Grab him and let's get this gate open. <laughs> Go on and grab the keys, Clem. Come on, scoot. Behind you! Okay, now where the fuck you come from? No, 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 no. Damn. Yeah, I see that. Go on and grab the keys, Clem. Come on, scoot. Behind you. Where the f seriously, like we weren't making no noises. How the fuck did they know where we were at? That, that's something I don't get. Man. Come on, come on with it. Come on with it. Oh, oh, oh. 
Everything's fine. Don't shoot me, please. Where? How? Keys, now! Bro, this is so... How the... Fuck, it's still locked. Are you serious, man? Use the key, you dumbass. Good. No, it did not go so good. But we're okay. Everything's okay. What's going on? I thought I heard a gunshot. We're fine. We found some walkers. You and an eight-year-old versus three of them, huh? Yeah, it looks like. What if you hadn't? I'm gonna go make sure the noise didn't cause us any problems. That's a good idea. I hope you know what you're doing with her. What's everybody do? <sighs> We're still alive, aren't we? Yeah, you are. Jesus Christ. Act like I don't know what I'm doing. Here we go. We got it. Let's go outside now. What did we learn? I'm not ready for a gun. We learned not to be afraid. They should have got us. But we got them. Yeah, you're right. Fear is the thing that will kill us. You understand? All right, let's go. I found a blowtorch in the station. Should make quick work of the coupling up there. Excellent. I'll come up there with you to have a look. There's a leak in it. Turn it off, dude. I, I don't want my eyebrows burned off. Better plug that leak with something. Hope there's holes. That's crazy. Look at it go. Just about got it. Thanks. No sweat, man. This thing is hanging by a thread. The smallest cut and it'll go. I can't reach it now. I can't reach it now. Damn it, it was just about done, too. Crap. Let me see if there's a... I can't reach it now. Here, the weak portion of the coupling's out of my reach. You think it'll be within mine? Huh, no. But I'm gonna dangle you over that ledge. The hell you are! 
The hell you are. God, you're a real son of a bitch, aren't you? Shut up and start cut. <laughs> Shut up. Guys, there's something coming. What the what? All those walkers. Thousands. We gotta go. Fuck. Omi, cut, cut. I am. It's going. Pull me up. Kenny, go. Come on, come on. Come on. We gotta jump. What? No way. Guys! Come on! Jump! No! Jump, damn it! Still no! Fine. Yep, fine, brother. <laughs> How do you how? How? Run. No, her, not me. Rista, no. Oh Fuck. shit. You piece of shit. She's a woman. Don't you know? Hey, I just I just went for the first dude, for the first one. I didn't even think it's gonna be one of those type of situations. That was a lot of them. Are you hurt? No, we're okay. Speak for yourself. My leg is fine. We're fine, Clementine. We're fine. Shit. Oh, Kenny and his family. Damn. Next stop, the Atlantic. We're finding Clementine's parents when we get there. I thought they were dead. Looking for them there. That's not the plan. Well, it's ours. She and I talked it through. Never get over today. That's all I keep thinking. Try to think about what's ahead of you. That's why I keep thinking it. I'll leave you to your thoughts. She's out cold like I've never seen. Whoa. That fucking thing was broken. So did I. Who the fuck was that? If he's convinced Clementine that he has her parents, y'all might want to rethink your plan. Oh. 
All right. We're almost at the river. You want to get on a boat? You want to wait around till the walkers figure out we're here? I know I promised that we'd find your parents, but Savannah's more dangerous than I thought it would be. I don't know how much longer he can keep on like this. If his leg gets any worse, we're gonna have to carry him. Or leave him. If I were you, I'd get out of the street. Now! Who the hell is this? Answer me, damn it! So when were you gonna tell us about the radio? Who have you been talking to? You come back here, I'll kill you! You understand? I will kill you! We done with Shadow Man, huh? Yo. Alright, let me see. Uh